Hey everyone, John Krasinski here, and today we're bringing you some important news from Gorman, where things have gotten a little toasty. The situation is quite serious, and we want to keep you informed with the latest updates. A wildfire, aptly nicknamed the Fire Fury, has taken hold, scorching through a whopping 12,000 acres of land. This massive blaze has been relentless, consuming everything in its path and leaving a trail of destruction. Yes, you heard that right, 12,000 acres. That's bigger than some small countries. To put it in perspective, that's about the size of 9,000 football fields. It's hard to imagine the scale of this disaster. But hey, at least we're getting a head start on our summer tans, right? Just kidding, please be safe, everyone. On a serious note, it's crucial to follow safety guidelines and evacuation orders to ensure everyone's well-being. The fire, which sparked up earlier this week, has been fueled by dry conditions and strong winds. These elements have created a perfect storm, making it incredibly challenging to control the blaze. The combination of high temperatures and low humidity has only exacerbated the situation. It's a stark reminder that nature, while beautiful, can also be a bit of a hothead sometimes. Wildfires are a natural part of many ecosystems, but when they occur near populated areas, the consequences can be devastating. But fear not, brave firefighters and emergency responders are on the scene, working tirelessly to contain the blaze. These dedicated individuals are putting in long hours, often in grueling conditions, to protect lives and property. They're true heroes, putting their lives on the line to protect the community. Their efforts are nothing short of heroic, and they deserve our utmost respect and gratitude. So, let's all take a moment to appreciate their dedication and bravery. It's times like these that remind us of the incredible strength and resilience of our communities. Stay safe, everyone, and let's support each other through this challenging time. The Gorman Fire, a name that sounds like it's straight out of a disaster movie, is unfortunately very real. It all started with a small spark, a rogue campfire perhaps, or maybe a lightning strike. Whatever the cause, it quickly escalated, turning into a raging inferno that's hard to miss, especially with all the smoke signals it's sending up. The fire has been particularly relentless, spreading rapidly due to the dry brush and gusty winds. It's like Mother Nature decided to turn up the heat, literally. But hey, maybe she's just trying to get our attention about climate change. On a serious note, our hearts go out to all those affected by the fire. The winds, those fickle forces of nature, have been playing a major role in the Gorman fire. They are the invisible hands that can either aid or hinder the efforts to control the blaze. They're like the unpredictable guest at a party. You never know if they're going to liven things up or completely trash the place. One moment, they seem to be cooperating, and the next, they're causing chaos. Right now, they're fanning the flames, pushing the fire further and wider. The gusts are relentless, making the fire's path even more erratic and dangerous. But there's a glimmer of hope on the horizon. Amidst the destruction, nature might just offer a helping hand. Weather reports predict a shift in wind direction, which could potentially help firefighters get a handle on the blaze. This shift could slow the fire's advance and give crews a much-needed advantage. Of course, we're all hoping for a downpour of epic proportions, the kind that makes you want to dance in the streets. Rain would be the ultimate ally, quenching the flames and bringing relief to the scorched land. But for now, we'll settle for a change in wind direction. Every little bit helps. Even a slight shift can make a significant difference in the battle against the fire. The community remains hopeful, watching the skies and praying for favorable conditions. Despite the fiery chaos, the spirit of Gorman remains unbroken. The community has come together in an inspiring display of resilience and support. Neighbors are helping neighbors, offering shelter, food, and a shoulder to cry on. It's heartwarming to see people putting aside their differences and coming together in times of need, because that's what humans do best, we adapt, we overcome, and we make the best of a bad situation. We've got this, Gorman! Let's take a moment to appreciate the real heroes of this story, the firefighters and emergency responders who are risking their lives to battle the Gorman fire. They're the ones running towards danger while everyone else is running away. They're working tirelessly day and night to contain the blaze and protect the community. They're true superheroes without the capes and tights, although we wouldn't judge if they wanted to wear them. So, to all the firefighters and first responders out there, thank you for your service, your bravery, and your unwavering dedication. You are the true embodiment of courage and selflessness. Amidst the fiery chaos, a ray of hope emerges as relief efforts swing into action. Organizations like the Red Cross and local community centers have stepped up to provide shelter, food, and supplies to those affected by the fire. It's heartwarming to see such compassion and generosity in action. It's a reminder that even in the darkest of times, there's always light to be found in the kindness of others. 
All eyes are on the skies as we anxiously await Mother Nature's next move. Will she unleash her fury with more wind and heat, or will she show mercy with a much-needed downpour? The latest weather reports offer a glimmer of hope. There's a chance of rain in the forecast for the coming days, which could potentially help dampen the fire's spirit. Of course, we're not expecting a monsoon, but hey, we'll take what we can get. To our friends in Gorman, please stay safe and follow the guidance of local authorities. Your safety is the top priority and listening to the experts can make all the difference. Remember, your safety is paramount. Always heed evacuation orders and take necessary precautions to protect yourself and your loved ones. Here are a few tips to help you navigate this fiery situation. These tips are designed to keep you safe and informed during such a critical time. Stay informed. Keep updated on the latest fire developments through local news and official channels. Information is constantly changing, and staying in the loop can help you make timely decisions. Knowledge is power, even when it comes to fire. Understanding how wildfires behave can give you an edge in staying safe. Learn about fire patterns, wind directions, and how different terrains can affect the spread of fire. Be prepared to evacuate. Have a go bag ready with essential items in case you need to evacuate. This should include important documents, medications, water, non-perishable food, and other necessities. Don't forget your toothbrush and a good book. Small comforts can make a big difference during stressful times. Listen to your inner voice. If you feel unsafe, trust your instincts and evacuate. It's better to leave early and be safe than to wait until it's too late. It's always better to be safe than sorry. Taking precautionary measures can save lives and property. Remember Gorman, you're not alone in this. The community stands together, and support is available from various organizations and neighbors. We're all rooting for you, and we're here to support you in any way we can. Reach out for help if you need it, and offer assistance to others if you're able. Stay strong, stay safe, and keep that Gorman spirit burning bright. Your resilience and courage are an inspiration to us all. Together we can overcome this challenge and emerge stronger.